Yo, what's going on, everybody? Alright, we are back with the new poo in Axie Infinity. I just picked up this Unko Poo Stank for my midliner here. Not sure how great he is, but I want to try him out. Test team. So the idea is to have your Unko as your fastest guy on the, on the squad and just have a couple beaters behind him. You know, you're going to have to have somebody to survive, I think, for your tank, which we do have some survivability here. 61 health with a watering can. But the cactus is going to be nice. If we're facing a midline aquatic, this is going to be huge. Carrot's decent as well. Also works for a tank when we're getting attacked into. And the Kataro is nice too when we can skip their slow tank. Unless they're playing triple tank or double tank. You know, triple plant, double plant. We'll see what we get into. And then we got a couple beast moves on this back plant here. I'm not sure if this should be a beast or if it's going to be okay as a plant. He's pretty powerful with the arrow, risky fish, and the dual blade. Pretty strong. The only problem is they're not on class moves for this plant. The only one is this cattail, which is a draw card, and it's not great on the back. So I'm not sure, but we do have some utility here. We got a Gota. We got a Rice. So our opponent really can't sit back that much. Not sure. So let's queue up here and get into a couple games and see what we can find. Okay, so our first opponent is an Antenna Squad. And we got no Unko. So right here, I think the play is just going to be double dual blade into a watering can? Huh? I could Kataro as well into a 35 speed. He won't be able to steal it. Yeah, what does our opponent want to do? You know, I think Nemo is nice on turn one, usually. Antenna is nice, so... I guess we'll just go Kataro here. Okay, so nothing from our opponent, so good call on a Kataro. Let's get a crit, maybe! No crit. All right, we'll gain one energy, but no crit. Hit, 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 hit. No critty crit. Hmm. Rice Goda. Watering can. Look, I mean, look at this guy. One, two, three, four, five. You know he wants to play aquatics. The only crappy part is he could combo this nicely and do an aquatic card into an antenna, which would be sick. He would basically be gaining energy for himself. I could just Kataro then, in that case. Maybe he holds again, or maybe he just does a double antenna. All right, you know, I'm going to do it like this. Just Kataro here. Okay, here we go. Oh, my goodness. So, watering can would have been sweet, but here he goes with the plan. He does two aquatic cards into his antenna. Oh, and he would have just eight, eight, eight. Now, we got to kill here. We got to kill. Oh, no, he's got pumpkin. He won't draw. We'll steal an energy, destroy an energy, and gain an energy. Okay, decent. Decent. All right, now what does he do? Just nothing? Man, you know, Unko, is it good? I don't know. Is it good? Is it a dead card? I want it to work. It doesn't particularly look great, but I like the idea. You know, instead of having a, a backdoor jumper... He makes a backdoor for your whole team, but I'm going to have to leave one on the table. I don't have enough cards, so hopefully he doesn't antenna us. Oh, he doesn't, but we follow up with the watering can. Give me two. Oh, yes. Give me two, baby. And we get a little sneaky attack in here. Carrot first. Of course. Yes, we did. Goda. Damn, and we, we're, we got double watering can here. So, Goda, arrow, arrow. You know, antenna, I'm a little scared of antenna. Okay. Watering can, dude. Watering can would have been slick. Let's see what he's got left. Anything? Ooh, we crit, dude. 35 morale showing him who's boss. Who is the boss? We want to know. All right, I can, I can imagine here he plays it weak. Mm. A single risky feather. 
So I must, you know, I don't want to blow my load with a double watering can here. I kind of do, but then again, I don't. Because if he bluffs or if he pump fakes, doesn't do anything, at least I'll have another watering can for next turn. All right, now he's coming, dude. He's bringing it hard, and he crits himself. Last stand? No. All right, you know, maybe I would have won. Maybe I would have won, or I'd still been alive if I would have watering can there. Double watering can. Okay, so here we go. If this was a beast, and this is the second time I think I ran into this with a plant in the back. If this was a beast in the back, I would all most certainly be dead. Right here, facing a dawn, a bird, aquatic. You know. But since it's a plant, I have a chance. Now, he could possibly pass here. You know, I don't want to draw that cattail. But if he antennas me, there ain't no way he antennas me, right? There ain't no way. Okay, I'm about to say, there ain't no freaking way he runs antenna there. No way! Ooh, but he gets the plus, the, the attack plus from the Risky Fish. So that's something great! Alright, we're going all out. Boom, 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 boom. Right? Is that the order? Boom, boom. Boom, boom. That's the order. He can't kill us. He can't kill us, dude. He got two energy. He can't kill us. Oh, no. He's got the double plus the feather incoming! Ooh, 187. He had the double attack buff what's that 40 percent, 20 and 20 all right so we'll take it man the poopy stanky the new poo let's get another one in here i don't know how i feel about it not sold not bought whatever the hell is the opposite but i want to do it i want to make it i want to see it i want to see some variety baby one of my team names actually is Variety. Variety. I want some variety, man, you know? What are we going to do here? I like Winghorn. I like Gerbil Jump. I like Shrimp. I like Toothless Bite. I like Little Owl. You know what else I like? A stinky poopy. And I want to see it. And also the ant. You know, there's another one out there. There's a tail. So you can have Unko apply stench. You know, I wonder if Unko lasted for two rounds. Would that be better? Maybe they should change it. Maybe they should buff Unko up a little bit, make it two rounds. I don't know if that would be too good. They would have to test it. I don't even know if that's what they're thinking. Maybe they make it do more damage or more defense. Whatever. But right now, I don't think it's working. I like it, though. I like the idea. You know, I'm, I brew, man. The brewmaster. I like the brew teams, man. I don't really like the cookie cutter teams. I like to brew it all up and make the coolest teams that you ever seen. All right, so we got a little out here, but no aquatic moves. That's, you know, this aqua stock, maybe it'd be better if it was a snail shell, something like that. All right, turn one. He's got a Gota, he's got a shell jab. What does our friend do here? This, what do we do? Just a Gota and a double smash? I think we did this last game. When I get the double smash, dude, I want to make it happen. Oh, crit! This guy crits! 157, time for your last stand. Dude, this guy crits, dude. I mean, what's that? Two games, two crits? Oh, yes! He be doing that, man. All right, let's just do a zero here. And a carrot... Yeah, you know, Goda's coming my way. Goda's coming my way. I would imagine. So instead of a carrot, let's do a watering can. Cactus? This 20, I sure hope that it breaks. And it doesn't leave him with one tick left. That would suck. Let's do it, baby. All right, he does nothing. All right, so the cactus is about to show him who's boss. I could have did a single cactus, but, you know, afraid of the Goda crit! Afraid of the Goda. Oh, baby, is he coming for daddy? That's the question. Is he coming for daddy? I could rice. How much energy does he have? Cottontail? Yeah, he might want to do something like that. I think I do rice. 
He might come in on me. He might go in on this dude. Who knows what he does, but I think Rice is the play here. I would say Carrot Hammer is the play, but Goda, dude. Goda! Plus, I want to have some D here from this bird. Let's do the rice. Show me the rice. All right, he's just going after my plan. So, show me the Goda. Make me feel real good. Show me the Goda. He does. Ooh, watering can, no. Watering can, no. But here's the rice. Here's where the rice comes in. You know, the utility of rice can't be understated. You want to do a cottontail? Yeah, so do we. We want that shit too, bro. Arrow. What do we do? Rice. Yeah, we just do it again. We just do rice watering can. And just, you know, clean up with an arrow. Fuck it. Because Goda, we don't want to see it. Oh, tell me, dude. Tell me he's bringing it with an aquatic card. No, he's just Cottontail? Oh, he loves it. Thank you. He loves us. The rice. Ooh, but it, it, it will pain me a little bit to drop this arrow on that guy. Ugh. An arrow on the last stand? All right, what do we do? Nothing? Do I do nothing? Does he kill me here? And if he does, can my plant beat this dude? With a horn disable, anti-crit. I mean, what does he... Does he beat me here? I think I passed the turn, man. I gotta pass the turn. Oh, he only uses two. Don't kill me. Don't kill me, bro. 158, he's not gonna kill me. I got last stand. Oh, I got ticks! I could have goaded there even. That you know talk about risky though. The goda right there was the mega risk. And here we go. He's probably just gonna drop one card. And what's he gonna do? Oh, zero cards! Alrighty then! Zero cards! The new poo! It's got people shook, baby. The new poo! It's got them shook! Alright, it's gonna be it for this one. Thank y'all for watching. Later!